solve the equation 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power 1 minus x is equal to 4. Hi everyone, welcome to my class, the Olusta class, where we teach mathematics and statistics. In this class, we're going to find the value of s from this given exponential equation. 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power 1 minus x is equal to 4. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power 1 minus s is equal to 4. Then remember if you have a raised to power n multiplied by a raised to power m is the same thing as a raised to power n plus m. Therefore our equation become 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power 1 multiplied by 3 raised to power minus s is equal to 4. Then we have 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power 1 over 3 raised to power s is equal to 4. Then let's multiply all through by 3 raised to power s. We have 3 raised to power s multiplied by 3 raised to power s plus 3 raised to power s multiplied by 3 raised to power 1 over 3 raised to power s is equal to 3 raised to power s multiplied by 4. Then this is 3 raised to power s multiplied by 3 raised to power x. Then if you have a raised to power n multiplied by a raised to power m, it seems in as a raised to power n plus m as we said earlier then this one will now be called to what 3 raised to power 2 s plus 3 raised to power s multiplied by 3 raised to power 1 over 3 raised to power s is equal to 4 multiplied by 3 raised to power x then this one will cancel this we have remember if you have a raised to power n raised to power m is same thing as a raised to power n m we same thing as a raised to power m raised to power n our equation become t raised to power s all square plus t is equal to 4 multiplied by t raised to power x now let's equate everything to zero we have t raised to power s all square plus 3 minus 4 multiplied by 3 raised to power s is equal to 0. Then we have 3 raised to power s all square minus 4 multiplied by 3 raised to power s plus 3 is equal to 0. Now let 3 raised to power s is equal to what? Y. Therefore we have y square minus 4y plus 3 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this by factorization method. Now let's look for two numbers such that the product will be plus 3 and the sum will be minus 4. If you have minus 3 multiplied by minus 1, it's going to give you 3. Then if you have minus 3, minus 3 that is minus 4 therefore our equation become y square minus 3y minus y plus 3 is equal to 0 then we have y into y minus 3 minus 1 into y minus 3 equal to 0 therefore y minus 1 equal to 0 or y minus 3 equal to 0 then from here y is equal to 1 also from here we have y minus 3 equal to 0 then y is equal to what 3 now remember that we said 3 raised to power 
s is equal to y therefore and the value of y is 1 and 3 therefore we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to 1 then for the first case then from here we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to 3 raised to the power 0 because anything raised to the power 0 is 1 then they have the same base this one will cancel this we have s is equal to 0 that is for the first case and also for the second case we have 3 raised to the power s is equal to y then at y equal to 3 then our equation become 3 raised to the power s is equal to what? 3 then this is same thing as 3 raised to the power s is equal to 3 raised to the power 1 they have the same base this one will cancel this s is equal to 1 this is also answer therefore our final answer is s is equal to 0 then 1 0 and 1 let's check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong now we want to check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong. The original equation is 3 raised to the power s plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus s must be equal to 4 at s is equal to 0 or 1. Now let's check at s is equal to 0. We have 3 raised to the power s plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus s must be equal to what? 4. Then when s is equal to 0, we have 3 raised to the power 0 plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus 0 must be equal to what? 4. Therefore, any 3 raised to the power 0 is 1. We have 1 plus 3 raised to the power 1 is the same thing as 3. Then minus 0, that is 0, must be equal to 4. Now, 1 plus 3 is 4, which is equal to 4. Then we satisfy the given equation at s is equal to 0. Now let's check at s is equal to 1. At s equal to what? 1. We have the original equation. <clears throat> 3 raised to the power s plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus s equal to what? 4. Then when s is equal to 1, we have 3 raised to the power 1 plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus 1 must be equal to what? 4. Now, we have 3 raised to the power 1 plus 3 raised to the power 1 minus 1, that is 0, must be equal to what? 4. Then we have 3 raised to the power 1 is the same thing as 3 plus 3 raised to the power 0 is 1, must be equal to what? 4. Then we have 3 plus 1, that is 4, which is equal to what? 4. We satisfy the given equation at s equal to what? 1. Our final answer are s equal to 0 and 1. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.